Hey everybody, I'm here at CES 2019 in LG's cool suite at the Mandalay Hotel. This is an 8K OLED television, the first one available on the market later this year. No price yet, it's going to be really expensive, but hey, it's an 8K TV and you also might have noticed it's pretty gigantic. This TV is 88 inches diagonal. That is really, really big. There's some larger TVs out there, but for an OLED TV, the biggest ever and of course the highest resolution with 8K. Now, of course, there's no 8K content today. 8K has dubious picture and quality improvements, even with a TV this large. But this is an OLED TV, which has the best picture of any technology we've ever tested. This TV would expect to be a spectacular performer. It's got this cool stand here. It's actually part of the television itself. It's a little rectangular silver thing. Of course, you can pop the TV off and wall mount it if you want. Look around back, there's speakers pointing up. And there's also a cool little flange along the bottom here to send that sound out into the room. It's a pretty nice overall design on this TV itself, very minimal as you'd expect from an OLED TV. LG says it's improved the video processing on this set a little bit. It's added some AI to the secret sauce there. It also has the ability to get some more noise reduction out of this set. So again, we expect a very good picture. Of course, this TV will be stratospherically expensive. So let's say you can't foot an 88-inch OLED and you still want 8K from LG. They're selling an LCD TV. This guy is 75 inches, 8K LCD. It's actually the smallest LCD we've seen so far in the United States announced for 8K resolution. Again, you get all of its processing and everything, but the picture is not going to be nearly as good because it's an LCD-based television. It should be pretty decent, but again, we'll have to know when we check it out. LG is also selling standard 4K versions of its OLED TVs. This is the E series. It's got a new design here. The bottom's nice and clear. They're also putting in some cool new features this year, including the ability to work with these clip speakers with a new WISA Wi-Fi standard that allows it to actually play full 5.1 surround sound without any wires. The set also has that improved processor, and LG says that it can work now this year with Alexa and Google Assistant. So you got both of those digital assistants on the TV at the same time. You long press on the Amazon button and you get Alexa on the TV itself. First time that's ever been done. If you're looking at LG's E9, this is a standard OLED television as in 4K resolution, not 8K. It's 65 inch here. There's also a 55 inch size and 77 inch size in some series. LG hasn't made too many changes in the, since the previous year. They've improved the processing a little bit, but this is a pretty standard OLED TV. LG has not told us its pricing yet this year, but you know, you do expect it to be relatively expensive just like it was last year. And again, one of the best performing TVs we've ever tested. LG has also made a couple improvements to its smart TV system. They have the ability now to interface with the smart home devices that are compatible with the set. You can pop up this smart home screen here and drive around and control things like lights and thermostats. LG says there's plenty of them compatible this year, so that's a nice new addition. You can also mouse over the Netflix icon here. You can see shows pop right up, individual shows you can jump right into. There's also the ability to rearrange the apps themselves. At LG can automatically sense which apps you've used the most and move those to the front of the line. That's a quick look at LG's 8K and 4K OLED TVs here at CES 2019. David Katzmeyer for CNET.